Welcome to St Peter's Church, Dunwich. This is the first footage ever made of one of the lost churches of Dunwich underwater. The visibility is exceptionally good, round about a metre here, whereas normally it's pitch black. As we descend to the bottom, what you can see uh, is a seabed strewn with flints and blocks of mortar um, made of flint and, and, and masonry, which are the remains of a collapsed church. St Peter's went over the cliff in Dunwich in about 16... Uh, 90 to 1700 um, and the remains are strewn across like a great artificial reef. You can see that that reef is being occupied by starfish and sponges that uh, colonise the surfaces of the rock and it's actually very difficult to see what's underneath them. Here you can see the sorts of conditions of fine silts just being kicked up there and, and, and those are what make it such a difficult site to work on. The interesting thing about this site, of course, is that it's the ruins of a ruin. But despite that, there are pieces of work stone that would enable us to get dates and to learn something about the construction and style of the church. But remember that there are no drawings of these churches. They went over before anyone had um, sketched them properly. Here the diver is just removing some um, overlying silt and sand from a a block, part of um, the walls or tower, um, which is actually made of calm stone imported from France. This suggests that there might be a Norman um, origin to this building. Here again we see a very good example of a piece of worked stone from St Peter's Church. Notice the edges here, still very sharp, beveled at the bottom here. And this is probably a coping stone from the top of the wall or an insert from halfway up the wall, such as you still see today in the East Anglian churches around the area of Dunwich. This is a, a very interesting site. Um, there are more south of here is the remains of St Nicholas's Church and to the north what we think is St Catherine's Chapel. More dives will be made and hopefully more interesting footage will be found and captured if we can get good diving conditions.